While football fans around the world focus their attention on the final four squads at the Euro 2008, another kind of football competition is going on. Robots are competing in Austria for the elusive European Robot Football Cup. Let's have a look. The European Robot Football Cup is being held in Linz. And like the Euro 2008, matches are played in both Switzerland and Austria. The spectators don't wear face paint or team shirts, but they watch with the same intensity as any football fan. The championship event has attracted top teams of scientists from countries including Germany, Russia, Canada, Croatia and Austria. This European championship, the robotic European championship, allows Austria to bring in two teams. <laughs> so uh, the expectations are really high to make one gold medal. Uh, and this, uh, compared to the other one, to the bigger one, uh, we, we, we didn't have a bit of a chance. <laughs> Austria's soccer squad took part in Euro 2008 for the first time ever this year. The nation was granted an automatic entry as co-host, but were forced to make an early exit. Their robotic team, however, made it to the finals. While England failed to qualify for the regular Euro 2008 tournament, the UK was represented with robots by Plymouth University. British robot engineers used artificial intelligence to ensure their players had both speed and agility. We have a camera here which, which looks at the pitch, at the ball, the goal posts, and the computer makes the, the, the decision, so this robot is completely autonomous. A camera registers a player's position 120 times per second and forwards the data to a computer which performs split-second calculations for the next play before it sends commands to players via radio waves. The only role for humans at these games are as spectators, as all the work is done by the machines themselves.